Welcome to the School of Chemistry at the University of Nottingham. Let me show you around. I'm on my way to the STEM lab, which is where we do all of our undergraduate synthetic laboratories in the School of Chemistry. In the STEM lab, there are 50 fume hoods. And although that sounds like a really big space, there's always someone on hand to help, including PhD demonstrators and lab technicians. In this fume hood, we have two setups of equipment, a reflux and a distillation. These are both examples of equipment that you'll be using in your first year at university. This lab is a paperless lab, so we all use tablets to make our lab notes and access the methods that we need. I'm using this rotary evaporator here to remove the solvent from my product. This is where I take my breaks during labs. We have a chemistry society that hosts socials, guest lectures and demonstrations. It's a really great way to meet other people in the department. I'm heading now towards the Nuclear Magnetic Resonance Suites, or NMR for short. Normally, undergraduates aren't allowed in here. However, the technicians are going to show me around. I'm sorry, but you guys are going to have to wait here. NMR is an analytical technique which we use to analyse the products which we make. It's mainly used by postgraduate students and summer students. However, in your first year, you'll learn how to analyse the spectra yourself. And in your third year, you'll get the opportunity to submit your own samples, which will be run for you for you to analyse. Here we have some history about the department and some awards. There are lots of opportunities to get involved in research at the University of Nottingham. I'm doing an internship in this synthetic lab. Over the summer, I've been working with some PhD and postdoc students on modifying proteins. This is where I'm working. Come with me. Welcome to the library. This is where all of the science books are located and it's also a really great place to study. There are lots of different study spaces in the library, some of which you can book. Group study spaces are excellent for working on lab projects. I like to come to the library to work on my lab reports, revise for exams and do my tutorial work. Tutorials are small group teachings where we can really consolidate what we've learned in lectures with a specialist academic. I've got something else to show you. If you ever need a periodic table, there's loads scattered about this building. This is X1, the largest lecture theatre in chemistry. At university, lectures are the main form of teaching, alongside workshops and tutorials as well. Shh, it's starting. I hope you've enjoyed coming around the chemistry building with me today. Bye.